So for the navigation for my course, um, since this is an intro level course, I try to make it very easy for students to find exactly what they need in my course. Um, all of the modules are uh, similar in structure. Um, everything is always going to be in the same place every week as they go through the course. Um, so they always know where to look for things. Um, so this is the, the homepage of the course right here. And you can see that um, I do my modules weekly. I do have a syllabus module and I also have, I use Pearson in my class so they can access their publisher materials from here as well. But you can see that each week has um, its own module right here. And I do give them announcements each week that duplicates some of the material that's shown in the, um, in the module itself. Um, so I give them what's due this week it's in the announcement and it's also in the module that they look at. So if we look at the module for this week, that's going to be week six. All of the modules look similar. Uh, so here's this one right here. Um, I give them a little uh, picture and then they have required activities and they have optional activities. And it's all of the dates, all of the things that they need to read, all of the dates when things are due that week. Um, any optional materials that are available, and then they can find everything that they need in the module itself. So there's their quiz, here's the instructions for their project, here's uh, training for their project, and each of their projects is here, and then their discussion is found down below. Each of the modules is the same except for um, midterm and final. Um, so they can always find things in the course, they always know what to look for, they always know where everything is going to be. It does not change each week. So it's very consistent for the students in an online course. This is a fully online course.